Riddler. Good day, Stoke friends and family. This is Thor from Stoke PVP. How's everybody doing today? What we'll start here is going to be episode two of Starship Traits. So we're going to cover is Invincible. It's going to be a quick summary of Invincible, not too in depth. The in depth videos will come at a later date once we get these basic videos out there. All right, Invincible, what is it? Where's it come from? What's the word come from? Low buy ship, the Zaw. If you're a PvP player, it's a must have trait. The unkillable part for eight seconds. That's the most important part in PvP. Now, before I go any further, I got to throw a little shout out to my sister unit, my sister fleet of Legion. I'm the KDF fleet leader of the KDF Legion. My man Demo, old Tom from Fed Legion. Please feel free to like and subscribe. I hope these videos help you evolve because you have not and will not ever beat my team in the arena. We destroyed you twice in a row. Just want to make sure everybody knows that since you were telling everyone that was lies. My vi the video is on my YouTube. Legion declared war on us because you know we like to share build information and we refuse to bear, bow to them and stop. They like to hide behind their little stealth and once we I start teaching people how to defeat stealth they get really upset. It's their lack of skill of PvP in this game. Now back to our topic. Invincible. Must have PvP. Unless you want to get insta killed. Now yes, the fifty percent Incoming healing, shields, all the good stuff. You'll be activated once every 120 seconds. So, you almost die. You can be like Noda Lizard from Rota and then run for two minutes and then come back and try to fight. This is how some people do. Smart technique, especially if you have you know, fast engines. One fault to this trait. If you're fighting a Psy Captain and they have something called subnucleonic beam, strips all buffs. If they hit you with a subnuke, once you hit 5% hull or lower, you, you're going to go from 5 to 0. It strips all buffs. That, un that unkillable for 8 seconds will go away. So don't feel overly safe and secure, especially if you're fighting a side captain. Now, tactical captains and engineer captains, they, they, they can't do this to you. But side captains, once they bring your hull down to around 5%, once they hit and they hit you with sub-nuke, they can take you way down straight to zero, no eight-second bull ride, straight to spawn you go, press X, and you take the ride of shame back up. Take other precautions. There's a lot of immunity consoles out there. A lot of super high defense consoles. You can get 10,000 defense for 10, 20 seconds to help you survive. So when you're fighting a side captain, you got to fight them completely different than when you were fighting a tactical officer or an engineer officer. Please feel free to like and subscribe to this. All comments are on a basis. There are a lot of individuals that do not like that I share the, the gatekeepers and build knowledge because I want this game to be fun for everyone and for everyone to know if they lose, they lost to a better player, not because that player had some kind of secret knowledge. So if this bothers you that I'm sharing this knowledge, that is great. Send me a thank you note. Go see your psychiatrist and tell them Thor sent you. I will write them a note and tell them they need to help you with your anger management and your lack of ability to lose and come back a better player. Feel free to like and subscribe. Have a great day, people.